Hi, I'm Dr. Rashmi Anas from Kempegora Institute of Medical Science, Bangalore. Hi, I'm Dr. Neha Rao from Kim's Bangalore as well. Uh, coming to our campus, we actually have academic oriented college in Banshatri and pure hospital with teaching, third year and fourth year teaching in uh, Kya market. And these two campuses are located approximately at a distance of 3 to 4 kilometers. And from second year onwards, when you're posted in the hospital, there is a bus facility which takes you back to the college. Both college and hospital are nearby uh, to the metro station and bus station. It's around 500, 400 to 500 meters to the nearest metro station. So this makes it convenient for people traveling from long distances as well. And coming to hostel, there's men's, Kim's Men's Hostel and Kim's Ladies Hostel just behind the campus of Banchantli College. Uh, the meals are pretty good and uh, two or three people will share each room. Uh, all the day there will be three meals per day and then uh, Saturday and Sunday you can also have non-veg meals too. There's also the Banshankri BDA complex which is a shopping complex just located behind the college hostel facility which makes it convenient for people who are hostelites. Coming to the four, first uh, four years of MBBS which will be your uh, theory and practical and then internship will break it down for you as follows. The first year consists of three subjects, anatomy, physiology and biochemistry. All will be in the preclinical uh, block which is again located in the Banshankri campus. Um, so in anatomy, first you are exposed to anatomy dissection hall. Uh, the anatomy dissection hall is uh, actually a transforming process which a medical student undergoes. First year teachers are really uh, sweet and they literally spoon fed to you. Uh, be, it, uh, theory be it in the theory classes, be it in detection hall, be it all other labs of first year subject anatomy, physiology and biochemistry. Anatomy coming to detection hall, there's five to six tables. Uh, 30 students will have uh, each cadaver. Uh, it, 120 to 150 students are there, like 30 uh, students will get uh, a cadaver. And uh, every day two hours of detection will be there, uh, which will teach you a lot about the human body. From your 11th and 12th, it's a huge jump in the volume of portions. So this process helps you gain your uh, uh, ability to understand and grasp this vast syllabus. In second year, you're also exposed to the whole uh, medicine clinical aspect. So you'll be going to the hospital in the morning for uh, around two to three hours and you'll be taking pa patient case history and you'll be examining the patients. Here, you'll usually be posted in the major departments, which are surgery, medicine, obstetrics and gynecology to name a few. Coming to the pathology lab, uh, there are a vast number of slides and uh, during the evenings you'll usually have your lab uh, postings. Um, the pay, uh, you'll be given different slides and you'll have to identify the diseases and it's in a very systematic uh, manner and you'll, we have to, you'll have to draw the diagrams in the lab book and uh, this process helps you again with your final exams. Microbiology, you'll have different staining techniques where you have to identify organisms, different uh, in bacteriology, virology, culture medias, etc. Again, the lab facilities are very good and the practical experience on hands-on training is also good. Coming to forensic medicine, this subject actually has very good exposure because a lot of cases come from central bank and you'll be exposed to a lot of autopsies where you can see a lot of cases, different causes of death and understand how forensic medicine is and you'll be able to write death summaries and identify bones etc. This is a part of your curriculum. Uh, the last subject which is pharmacology, most of the practical aspects have actually reduced generally all over in all medical colleges but despite that our uh, medical college has a very uh, wholesome um, practical experience where they make us understand each class of drugs and help us uh, gauge these classifications and the teaching again is very good in this department with regular classes especially on antimicrobial agents beautifully taught by most of the staff.